Hey guys, welcome to the first video of my channel. Uh, today we are going to be playing some Minecraft. Uh, we're going to try to uh, have our go at a survival series. Uh, yeah, so let's begin. So, the name of our world is going to be... The Llama's World. How about that? That sounds nice. Llama's world nothing don't really have to change anything so let's begin start chopping down this tree right away because we're gonna need some tools we're gonna we're gonna survive the night survive all those mobs okay once you're gonna finish chopping down this tree we'll have to get some food as well so Oh, I'm gonna kill those sheep. Get their wool. Hopefully, make a bed. So we can just quickly sleep through the night without having to eat anything out. Bonk. Die, sheep. Ha ha ha. I need your wool. Give it to me. Okay. Alright. Your next sheep. Don't run. It's useless. I need your wool, please. Okay. And hopefully there's one more sheep around so I can get a bed. Please tell me there's another sheep around. If there isn't, I'm going to be pretty, pretty sad. Hope. Oh, there's some sheep over there. Um. Or is, yeah, that's cheap. Hopefully, by the end of today's episode, we'll be able to access the Nether. Because since it's the 1.16, it's a lot easier because of portal remnants. Nothing to see there, Mister. That's right. Yeah, because of the portal remnants, it's going to be a lot easier to get to the Nether. And there's a lot more new things never to look. Okay, there's some iron. Just need to get wooden pick, then stone pick, and then iron, which is great. Then we need to build our house. Because if we don't have the house, then the monsters will come out and then we'll die. Which we don't want to die. Because dying is a bad thing. It's not very good for your health. Okay, hopefully we can find, ah, the crafting table. Oh, and sticks. Oh. Useful. But we need more than just that. So we'll make a couple more sticks. And a pickaxe. Man, I'm getting pretty laggy. And we also need to craft a bed. Alright, now that we have tools, we'll just get this crafting table, mine some stone, craft a stone pickaxe, then mine that iron. And we also need to craft a furnace, so uh, should we craft a stone sword? Probably, yeah, okay, I'm going to also craft a stone sword, so we'll need 13 cobble stone for that. There we go, 13 cobble. Now we just need to find that iron again. Oh yes, and we also need coal to smelt the iron. Uh, because coal is one of the most useful smelting. It's super easy to get. And super easy to get and cooks like eight, eight pieces of anything. Unless you're using like a blast furnace or a smoker. Yeah, I know. I have knowledge. So let's mine up this coal and quickly go get the, make a stone pick and some a furnace, and get that iron before it turns nighttime. And then we also have to build a house. Hopefully. Oh dang it! Why didn't? Oh man. Okay. Okay, we don't need that much coal. 
anyway. So I think that's enough for to that smelt. So we quickly. Oh hey, this oh creeper. That's not gonna be good. It's already mob spawning. Although it is in a cave and creepers can spawn in dark levels, so nothing really to worry about unless I accidentally fall into that cave. There it is, there's that iron. Okay, we also have to craft up the items that we need. Stone pick. Uh, stone sword. And a furnace. There we go. Alright. Mine up this cobblestone. I mean, uh, iron. Yeah. Only two pieces. Hmm. We need three. So we need three to make a. Throw that in the furnace. Should I go for that iron that's in the cave? I can try. I do have a sword. Okay, I'll make an axe so it's easier to drop down stuff. And then I'll. Then I'll get some more wood or should I yeah I should make a stone axe so it'd be a lot better. Stone axe would be a lot better than just a wooden one. We also need to cook some food because I'm getting a bit hungry right now. Okay. Just three pieces of cobblestone. Convert that into planks. You know what I don't Something that confuses me about Minecraft is how does one cubic meter of oak wood turn into four cubic meters of planks? That just doesn't make a lot of sense. Okay, need sticks. And then we get axe. Chop, chop. Chop, chop, axe. And then we'll plant some trees. I'll make my base like right here. Seems pretty good to me. Yeah, let's build our base right here. Hopefully we can find like a portal remnant nearby somewhere. That's very dark cave, I don't want to go down there. Very spooky. Spooky scary skeletons. And uh Hopefully we can, yeah, as I was saying, hopefully we can find a portal remnant nearby somewhere so we can, you know, I think I'm going to mine up a bit more coal so I can make some torches. Uh, there we go, torches. Alright, let's find that cave that we saw before. Or whatever that was. I think it's this way. Huh. That's odd. Anyway. Man, I'm saying anyway a lot, aren't I? So. Let's find that cave. I think this is... Okay. No, it's not. Come on, where is that... Where's that darn cave with that iron in there? Damn iron always hiding from me. I need to eat. Getting. I hunger. There we go. Full hunger bars. I th Is this? No, it's not. This, this is not it. This is a... Oh, God. Where's that cave? Man, I, I found it so easily before. Now, why can't I find it? Why can't why can't I find it again, man? Oh hey, ooh pumpkins. Pumpkins are a good thing. For a second, I thought it was a village. Bonk. Mm -hmm. I hit you with your own child. Man, there are a lot of eggs around here. Ooh, a desert. Hmm, that could be helpful. 
Oh, desert village. Yes. Let's go. Oh, hey. Baby chicken. Baby. That's this is great. Okay, I, let me get... Okay, now I don't need, really need to find that iron. Okay. Let me go grab my stuff, and then we're going to move in or next to that village, at least. Man, that was really lucky. Hopefully they have good stuff, like, um... They hopefully they have good stuff like the uh, blacksmith. Yeah, that's the best. Uh, that's the best uh, village housing to find because it has really useful tools. So hopefully there's one there and they, and they has good stuff. Maybe we can even find diamonds. Imagine we find like diamonds. On the very first episode, ah, imagine. Okay, let's grab the stuff. Oh wait, I forgot the stuff smelting in here. Okay, anyway, it, it's it's finished cooking, so it, it's fine. it's fine. And if it starts to get dark, we can always just s s decide to stay in one of the villager houses. And hay bales. Oh, that would be a that would be make a lot of wheat which would be great oh man I'm really happy that I found this village okay okay yeah let's go let's go make a new home in our village in their um not our their new village or our village just our village it's not anyone's village oh the sun setting great timing that I found this otherwise I have to try to speed build the house or like or something who knows maybe just maybe we can find something good maybe who knows who knows there could be a desert temple somewhere nearby or whoa well hey that looks cool what's that up there huh kind of looks like a house someone built oh it's getting dark okay Oh, and there's some cows as well. Beef replenishes a lot of hunger. I know that. Or steak, not beef. It's right next to a mountain. This is an odd sand village. I mean, it's sand, but hmm, odd. Ooh, okay. Okay, let's quickly find this blacksmith's. Smithery, there it is over there. Okay. First, I'm gonna, just gonna. First, I am going to make this my spawn point. Yay! All right. Now let's go take stuff from this village. Don't mind me, Iron Golem. Just taking all your resources. You know, Iron Golems are a bit broken. In my opinion. Because you can do anything to the village. As long as you don't touch the villagers, then the Iron Golem won't care. But if you if you hit, like, if you accidentally punch a villager one time, you can go crazy. That's it. not making any sound. Did I? Uh, let me check first. Okay, I made it so it makes sound. Yeah, ding, ding, ding. Uh, I wonder why there was no sound. Okay. What's this? I've never seen one of these. Oh, I think this. Oh, yes. Okay, here. Yes, give me that. Brewing stand. And stuff. Ooh, lapis lazuli and bread. Some rotten flesh. I, I guess I could use that as food. I don't really have to, but. Oh, maybe I could find, like, a. Maybe I can find a. What what are they called again? Um, Priest, yeah. Maybe I could find a priest. Ooh, yes, iron and an iron helmet. 
I mean, not really as good root as I've seen before, but good enough for me, I guess. Hmm. What do they sell? An emerald for six bread. Wow. Okay. No, he sucks. This guy's. That farmer sucks. His trades are pretty bad. Okay, so. Uh, let's find. Like, I. Because I know there's a. a oh, wow. Okay. Seems like there's, like, two cards out of this. Ooh, spider. Where's that spider? I hear, I hear en enemy mobs, but I don't see them anywhere. Three cartography tables. If you find a map, that would be pretty helpful. Where's this spot? Oh, wow. Man, these guys must like maps a lot. Where's this spider? Oh, oh wait. Oh, there's a cave down here. This is where, be where the mobs are hiding. Man, okay. Ooh, hey, cut, 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 cut. Cat. Oh, wow, okay. That's a big and scary cave. I am not one to go in there. A crafting table. Okay. I am going to see if these trades are up. Same trades as before. What is that noise? Zombie. Oh wow, 24. 24 1. Impressive. That's a that's a pretty good trade. You know what? Here. It's this guy. It's this guy, right? Yeah, okay. I'll just make note that that's you. I'll, as I take all your your resources. I'm I'm just gonna take a stack. So that I never have to really run out of food. I'm a very evil person. My axe is already almost out of durability. I guess that's karma for taking the. Is it any faster? No, it's it's still the same with. Oh, oh I accidentally put down the crafting table. Still the same with my fists. Oh, I guess I didn't really have to use the the crafting table, uh, the axe, but I did anyway. Huh. That's a, yeah, I guess a bit of karma right there. Hey, Mr. Iron Golem, please don't hurt me. I'm totally not stealing the, your village's most precious resources right in front of your face. Okay. I'm going to chop down tree, some trees, um, and make my own house. So I don't have to live in the village. Because so I don't want to live in the village. So how big is our house going to be? I'm not going to make it too big. Probably like not not too big. Um, nine stacks of hay. That would give us three stacks of bread. Okay, I'm going to build my house right here. Right here seems like a good place. Okay. No, oh, I got cute cat. Uh, six by six. So no, s seven by seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, three, four. Five, six. Oh, I need more. Good thing I have extra oak logs. Um, I sh probably would need, need more resources. No, doesn't seem very big house. Should probably make it a bit bigger. 
like just expand it a bit. Not exactly symmetrical, but when has anything ever been symmetrical? Ah, uh, yeah, okay. This house seems to be coming along pretty well. And because I am master builder, because I professional, I'm a professional at building. I will add side logs like this, so it looks fancier than it actually is. Than my poorly built house actually is. It makes it look better, but not really. It's not really better at all. Necessarily. Okay. I'm just gonna put my bed here. Put down my crafting table. And my furnace. There we go. Oh, yes, I should probably make some bread. I have a lot of bread now. I'm math. I'm the bread master. I need more oak planks as well. Oh, I need to make a some doors to my house. In my opinion, I like the spruce. I like spruce or dark oak doors the best. Just look a lot cooler, in my opinion. So let's get building. I want to be at least be able to stand inside my house and, and be able to jump. We're going to need some more wood. Man, there's a lot of noise. I usually because I usually play with sounds off, so because well, sounds are slightly annoying so I think I might turn the sound down a bit later okay okay so I've made it a little bit quieter for my own sake but there's still volume, so you can still hear it. It's just a, it will be a little bit quieter as well. Okay, I think I have enough old leaves. Yeah, okay. So we're gonna make it the. F I'm thinking. Yeah, okay. I'm thinking that I should add two floors to my house instead of only having one. So the first floor. It's going to be four blocks high, and then like a roof of some sorts. Then I'm going to have stairs going upwards to the second floor. Uh, floors going up to the second floor, and uh, have the second floor stuff on the second floor. If that seems... Uh, so, four blocks, and on the fourth... Oh! Ow. And the fourth block is the roof. I'm gonna need a lot more oak, oak logs to build this kind of house. Why do, why do Minecrafts give you three doors? Like, why do you need why? My question has always been why? Why do you need three doors? Ooh, we're getting close to our second night. Oh sheep! Fine, you know what? You get to stay. You get to stay. I'm keeping you as a sheep. Yeah. You will now be 
I shoot that. Wait, no, get in the hole. Get in that hole. Now let's go to sleep before bad things happen, like mob spawn. Now, we need to get some more wood for to finish making our house. And then we need to also get also more wood to... And stone as well. I should probably make a pickaxe too. Yeah, okay. So, the plan is get more wood, make us an iron pick, pickaxe, and uh, make us a, a second stone axe because our first one is close to breaking. It looks like the bar's already red, the durability bar. Okay, so I think we're just going to end the video when I f finish building my house. Um, we didn't really, I guess, we didn't really succeed at our getting to the nether in the very first episode. But we'll get there eventually, so it's nothing I really have to worry about. Chop down this entire forest to the ground. Although, mm, mm -hmm, there's a mountain over there. I, I'm really happy that I found this village because now I have extra stuff that will most likely help me a lot. Alright. I need to chop down more wood. Oh, yes. And some stone. I need stone for my pickaxe. Imagine if you could use, like, diorite and andesite and, and all that for... to make stone pickaxes. It would give them a lot more use other than really just, um, decoration. Because not, a lot of people don't really use or like andesite and diorite. Ah, oh, no, mobs. That's a bad place. Because, I mean, it doesn't... And not a lot of people use it in decoration as well. If, because, in my opinion, it doesn't look very good. The texture. I'm gonna burn through this axe and then head home. My axe broke, so we need to go back and make a another axe anyway. Which is a great time just to go back and just fix the house a bit up a bit more. Finish the first floor. Finding the village was very helpful, so I'm just gonna i I'm just gonna say that again. Because villages are very very good. Why am I not picking up this egg? Oh, there we go. Oh, I'm lagging a lot as well. Okay. The only problem is, uh, it's not really else other than this village. And there's still not a lot in the village, so probably need to, we're definitely going to do it. need to be doing a lot and a lot more adventuring soon. Ah, oh, there's the music. Minecraft music is very lovely. It just brings a tear to the eye. It's wonderful. Anyway, let's... 
let's finish up the sides of this house. Who knows, this might be made possibly the only floor. I'm still thinking about it. There's our little sheep friend. Over a stack of wood. Let's go. Okay, I probably don't need that much wood. I probably should have not made like a stack of wood. Anyway, I'm gonna change up the floor as well. Floor. Oh, and I need torches as well. I use these torches. Well. Put some torches here, and on the outside as well. Wow, huh, exactly enough torches. Who would have thought? Anyway, let's make this axe. Oh, and we also need a chest to put all our stuff in eventually. Okay, I'll let, yeah, okay. Craft a chest. Let me make it a double chest here. Still have 30 wood left to spare. Uh, I'm gonna put this chest right here. Let's walk down. And I probably should put down this brewing stand here, so I can for later use. All right, now let's go chop down a few more logs, make iron picks. And that will be the end of the video, I guess. All right, let's go. It's going to take very long. For those who are still actually watching the video and haven't left because of bore pure boredom, well, thanks for sticking and watching this video till the very end. Really thankful for it. This is probably a pretty amateur video by a lot of people's standards, so I'm happy that people have st just stuck with me to the end and s watch, watch this video to the very end. I just want to thank those people. Just anyone who's still watching, I just want to thank you for just staying here and watching this video because honestly, it's not a very good made, it's poorly made. I, I don't think a lot of people will see it. And uh, if, if you think this video is good, actually, uh, I guess you could subscribe. I'll, I'll be posting more videos, definitely. We'll definitely be posting more videos, so so yeah, you could watch those out too. This is the very first video of this channel, so I'm happy that I actually got it to start a channel. I've tried a few times before, but hasn't really worked out for me because I'm really busy. So I'm glad that I had I've had the time to actually do this now because of the whole thing. So, I've had a lot of free time, so I just thought to myself, hey, why, why not start my own YouTube channel? It help me. Just, it, it will help me have something to do. If, and I guess, uh, if you're bored, you could watch my videos as well. So, it's a win-win situation for the both of us. Me and the viewers. The, the next episode we're going to be doing... A lot more exploring and uh, mining to get more resources so we could actually explore. So let's craft up this pickaxe.
I don't really like to use my iron pick until my stone pick is fully uh, broken. Just use this as fuel because I'm uh, I'm too lazy to to just open the chest for coal. Okay. If I believe so, the way to do it is like this. That's how you make it look fancy. Make the logs position sideways. And. Ooh, still don't have enough wood. Oh, man. I still don't have enough wood. At least, at least it looks like better, I guess. Not really. But we'll have to, we'll have to, there's still a lot of work to do. If we want to finish, oh wait, I had coal right in my, oh, I had coal in my inventory, what am I talking about? It's a dark oak forest right here, I don't think dark oak and oak, I think there'll be a much, a very big contrast. So I don't think I can use dark oak. Uh... Man, this is taking a lot longer than I thought it would. Ah. You know what I really wish you could do? I wish there was a way to turn planks back into wood. That would be so helpful. Or like... It's, somehow you could get like wooden objects and turn it back into... Oh, what's this? Is this like a lava pool or something? Looks like a former lava pool, but not anymore. I just wish like there was a way to get like wooden objects and turn it back into ordinary logs, like retransfer stuff, or like for example, you accidentally make forty-seven diamond boots because you misclicked, you accidentally shift clicked or something. I wish there was a way to be able to just convert to them back into their original source like a D crafter oh no it's getting dark oh no 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 that's not that's not gonna be good quickly chop down logs and run all the way back home otherwise the mobs will get us and that will not turn out good man I've been really lucky so far I mean, not as lucky as before, like, one time I was playing Minecraft with a couple of friends, and when we spawned in, there was, like, um, there was a ruined portal not so far away, but one time uh, there was also, um, I spawned on an island, and uh, on a, a, sm a pretty small island with trees, and I had to travel for about, like, 200 blocks before we actually got to, like, a large patch of land. I'm gonna get 30 and then quickly get the heck out of here. Hopefully I don't die on the way. Oh, I can craft- oh wait, I can craft, craft a shield, okay. I'm gonna craft a shield when I get home so I can defend myself. Alright, let's get out of here. I'm freaking out. I need to get the hell out of here. Oh, squid. Let me put you out of your misery. Okay. Now, at least I can turn my bed to a black bed now. So I have pink sacks. I see my house in the distance. Quickly run. There's still no mob spawning, which is good for me. I see the light. Head towards the light. Go, 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 go. Around. I can make it. I believe. Please, please don't die as soon as I'm like right outside my house. You know what's another odd thing that I just thought of? When you die, you always get seven levels back, which is odd. Like, why seven? What's so special about seven? How about all the other numbers? Okay. Why only seven levels? Like, no matter how many levels you have. It's always seven in the end, which is, which is what I th I think that's odd, as well. I, 
Mojang should fix the 7 XP level death bug. And now we have a shield. Oh, spider. It's the sound of a spider. Okay. Finish up the house and uh, that will be the end of the video. Oh, saw the mob burn to death. What's that noise? I hear. Oh, spoiler. No hostile. No hostile. No hostile. Good. Should I kill you? I'm gonna kill you. Oh yeah, monster hunter. Hopefully, I can get like a bow or something. All right, completed house. Oh yeah, we have finally a completed house. Ah, let's put everything in the chest. Uh. Well, I'm going to leave it on that note. Thanks for thanks for watching to Thanks for watching this video, I guess. Okay, that's lagging. Now you are killing me. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm just going to climb cuz I have a lot of wood. Anyway, Thanks for watching this episode of my Minecraft Let's Play. Very first episode of the channel. It's very poorly made though, so anyway. But anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, if you haven't already, I guess you could subscribe, like the video. That would mean a lot to me. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later. Goodbye.